Now, Michael, off with you, off with you swimming. That's the boy. Nice and slow now. Goodbye, Michael. That's the boy. Goodbye, Mike. Nice and slow now, the way you're doing it all the time. Goodbye, Michael. That's the boy. Around now, we've got a good turn around now to come back. That's the boy, down along. What age is that little fella, Peter? Uh, he's about uh, age, around age. Will he be all right? Yes. He's, he's his How long has he been swimming? Well, he can down, he's been down with the children, with his brothers, to have uh, eight and seven or eight of them in family between brothers and sisters, and he's been down watching. So it was very kind of a nervous child. So we asked him one, one very warm day to go in. And uh, when I seen him go in, I met him take courage. And I continued on with him this year only. And uh, you put him on the hand. put him on the hand as he was a non-swimmer. And now you see the result. He is a swimmer. But I have been in touch with his father last night. He's one of the youngest we have. To ask him to know, would I take him off of the rope? Or would he prepare to leave him on till the season is over, you see? Yes. So the father said, uh, please myself. Yes. So I took the option of keeping him on till the season of the a while. Yeah. Now, He's a perfect swimmer. He's all set for to take off the rope. You have taught all these children, in fact. How many children have you taught to swim? Since well, you started it, it should be a, it should be an impossibility to put a number sort on, on, on all. But I'd, I'd honestly say that there's two or three from every family in the whole area between Killaloo and Ballina allowed to swim. So that would be well over a hundred children. Well, of course it would. How is it that you, a non-swimmer, now, you don't, you're not a swimmer yourself. No, I yourself. don't swim at all, no. Well, you, what suddenly made you decide, one, that you should teach well, them I to swim, and then that you could teach them to swim? The thing was that no one was taking an interest, you know, in the swimming line. And we could get no one to take the interest. So one day, uh, I picked up a bit of courage, and I said, if I learn five, I'd learn 25. So it was a one season of, I say, a batch of about uh, 10. I learned five children to swim. And was very happy about it, and then I continued on and got to college. But how, how did you go about it in the first place? I mean, not knowing how to swim yourself, what did you say to children? You just put them on the I rope. Put them, I, I, I was told, I was told uh, by an experienced gentleman that if I gave him the, uh, the leg kick and the arm movement for the breast and only learned them on the breast, I was away with it. That the breaststroke was the only stroke essential in swimming as regards life saving. What sort of swimmers are you producing? I'm just looking at some of these here, they can swim well, well, but do you produce any sort of outstanding swimmers? They can do all types of swimming now, as you see there. But them two children in the water, I only offered the rope this year when they're what are called swimmers. Before you came along to teach the kids here about to swim, Peter, I suppose there would be very few people in, in Killaloo, Bellina, who could swim. Well, at the time we began, when we farmed out Love way back in 48, uh, there was no, no recognised swimmers, only very few, a bulk of 12 or maybe 20. And now the bulk of the children in the town In the town, swim. all the town children can swim. And we're uh, asking more to come. And as late as last night, a record was um, established when I put in a child of uh, a year and four months, and another child of uh, three years and another child of four. So they'll and all be able to swim before they're five or six Before anyway. they're five. Well, my ambition is to try and do that, to give a record to the swimming you, you, you do this as a purely voluntary effort. Oh, no, Nobody no. pays you. No, no one pays us. You no. spend a lot of time. I, 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 I actually lose my work to do it. How's so, that little fellow on the end of the road? Yeah, he might be tired. We're tired from standing. We'll give him another go. We'll just give him another, another go. go. Yeah. Turn around now, Michael. What? Turn around a bit this way and come back again. Come on, you're well able. Yes, he's, he's very... He's like a little frog, isn't he? Yes, just <laughs> back to me now. That's the boy. He's only this year after being learned, and he's yeah. really he's really natural. It's an awful thing to have to train ch children in that, in that water. Yes. In the you, what you really need is a swimming pool. A, a, a swimming pool. There's anything. There's 14 feet of water there now. And you just imagine teaching children in that water and having to look at the rest of them. Mm -hmm. Because the, uh, any other day, that today, I would have no... One only myself. Yeah. You're doing yeah. a great job. Yeah. I'll you better get that little fellow yeah. up before he freezes. I'll take him over to the far okay, side. Okay, yeah, okay. Come over to the far side, Michael. That's the boy. Keep moving, girls. Keep moving. <laughs>